Bro, you know last time we used to go to chalet. You could go chalet right last time. Have like down down east, sunny, only to go. Yeah, go. you know. Yeah, I also got go. And always people say like, "Hey, let's go red house." You got here. Oh, <laughs> bring yeah. back memories, bro. Bro, at the point of time, like everybody say, "Okay, let's go, let's go there." And night time, every chickens out. But have you heard about the stories? I have heard about the do's and don'ts. Like, like you must climb over the gate or something. You can open the door. Then, like before you go in, you need to like light a cigarette during the extension, like the extent of the cigarette before it burns out. You need to be out by Yeah, then. so like apparently before you enter you must give some offerings like it can be like cigarette or like sweet or like coins like easy link like that. Paranormal <laughs> ERP. <laughs> Singapore everything must pay, bro. <laughs> <laughs> apparently there are stories are uh, like when you enter Ray House, then uh. the two stone lions will like look at you. Like the stone lions outside they will follow you as you walk. So now Ray House has been demolished and now that site has been built into a preschool. Singapore is a generally very superstitious, so yeah. Patang lah, so I think before demolishing and before rebuilding the place, I'm pretty sure they did like, you know, rituals or whatever just to cleanse or something like that lah. Yeah. So, uh, but actually, uh, I yeah. heard that when they were doing mm-hmm. the renovations, right, like okay. there were rumours saying that like some of the workers like fall sick and all that, you know. Like, How you know, you go to the preschool, right? No wonder. No wonder, no wonder. 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 No